wow. the kid, King Ray Jr. The dude's getting taller. It was freaking me out. I told him to slow down. Yeah, man. Don't make me feel old. Quit right? that. Stay in school. Yeah. And, like, stop getting taller because I'm my, he's almost my height, so I don't like that. He's, he's already taller than Rickster right now. He just yeah. dunked on Rickster and took his hat. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, <laughs> I'm sure he did. I'm sure, I'm sure he didn't even have to jump that high. <laughs> no, no disrespect to Rickster, of course. Oh, man. That's true little kidness right there, man. He playing with, a, with the Indian, Indian style? Okay, all right. Oh, you can still do that? All right. You can still do that now that his junk hangout? All right, that's cool. What's wrong, Steve? You all right? I'm okay. Right, right? I knew you would react. Oh, my God. <laughs> Anyways, we're into the matchup. He's picking Austin, of course, what he's known for and going up against the shadow. <laughs> all right, here be we careful. go. Yeah. <laughs> you all right, Steve? Oh, I'm okay. <laughs> man, that story you told me before about Oil King. Oh, oh man, God, that man, was we can't do it. <laughs> Let's see, we already know, man. Anyways. Young Junior, not there yet. All right, here we go. Uh-huh, the follow-up here. Harassing with the knee. Trying to, I, I like this, though. I mean, you think about it. See, he's going for those reversals, and that mm -hmm. that's not going to work against Shadow if he's going for those knees. Fight. Yeah, that's one of the strengths Claudio has in this matchup. He's gonna make you try to fight back in that range. Fish for a few counter hits. Can can kicks came from uh, Mr. Junior. Back three. Finally find the launcher right now. He's gonna I, hit the wall. I really like the offensive choices that we're seeing from Shadow so far. Ugh. But he does have to be careful because we've said it before, man. Asuka hits like a truck, like a like a semi. Yes. 18 wheeler. Oh, that hop kick. So classy. Okay. Superman punch. Gets the starburst as well. Dancing a little bit, getting a little closer to the wall. Steps right into it. Pulls the triggers. Let's it rip. Spins the uh, starburst. Step to the game of love, baby. Okay. You have to be careful. You can't just throw that out. Players like Shadow will be able to duck and punish accordingly. Yeah, you can tell the uh, King Ray Jr. is trying to sidestep in some of these instances. Okay. Trying to get something started right now. Here we go. Goes for the knee. The follow up here gets the nice sidestep attack. Yeah, King Ray. Oh, okay, finally gets the big. wrist chuck. Yeah, wrist chuck slam. The follow up here. Look at that. Has it by the wall. And look, what are you going to do? Okay, finally gets oh, the Oh, that's throw. one thing, Rage Art. Let's go. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Whip. Oh, no. Oh, okay. All right, sidestep. Wow, that was bad draw. I should have let him fall down a little more. But that was a really high wall splat, though. I didn't, I didn't expect it to even splat that out. too tall for him, right? He's yeah. not there yet. Damn it. That was rough, though. <laughs> That was really weird. I never... it, it, it was interesting because, you know, he was up there and he went for it. It barely missed. I thought he was going to go for the Rage Art because he did go for the standing forward before that as well. But either way, that was a, a rough opportunity there for Young King Ray Jr. I mean, at least he was in. He had the right idea. That was definitely what you needed to do to close out that match. Yeah, but Shadow, no emotion again. Just going back into the battle. Business as usual. Let's see how. Uh, if there's going to be some adjustments here from King Ray Jr. And now we're going to the hammerhead stage. And one of the things, I mean, we talk about this all the time, you know, the axis of the stage when you start off, uh -huh. you got to be very careful on how you make these commitments to these jungles because oh, the yeah. side wall slam comes into play. And for certain characters, especially like Claudio and maybe even Oscar especially, you're not able to get nice clean hits on the combos. You're going to have to kind of be wary and kind of just back off towards the end. Yeah, readjustment has become a big thing, especially in, like, in Tekken now because you get those weird wall splats and you're going to need to be able to like quick adjust and makes like and just make small modifications on the fly unless you have like a designated wall combo right there's people that do that you see jimmy a lot of times he has like exactly what he wants to do and that's exactly the kind of situation we were talking about right there all right here's a follow-up nice sidestep there from shadow oh he went for the reversal again he's gonna have to be careful because of the whip punish he look at made. that he's keeping him there Oh, second hit. He wasn't ready. Okay. All okay. right. Get, get something on the board. Out both there from King Ray Jr. Showing some good signs of life here. And again, he didn't do too bad that last matchup. He just had to make sure he clutched it out. Okay. Finally finds his mark. All right. Gets the one plus uh -huh. two. The follow up there. Goes for the beat down punch. But again, the rollback. Oh, nice down. Four, three on follow up. Shadow getting a little impatient. Quick side step. Oh, the running attack. And the ball quick man. walk. He's just not letting him get it. He's, get off of him. He's just me. harassing him with that knee. Okay, now what we're going to see, nice side step there for. Oh my God. And once again, Did man. Did you see the way he just pulled that out? Yeah. Every time. He's just sitting on it the entire time. 
gets a read on when Rick King Ray Jr. wants to move, and that's when he every time he pulls the pin on. Because you know that's not the fastest move, really. It's, no, it's, it's not, not that fast. But the, the fact that he knows it's going to hit makes it count. Yeah, yeah reading players. Reading a, a Tekken player is not easy, but once you get those reads, that's when we talked about stuff like crouch throws and stuff like that. You're able to do those more unconventional things, more damage, and it kind of like, you know, it makes another player uncomfortable, especially if you're getting hard calls like that. Yeah, another wrist chuck slam. If you can start making your opponent second guess themselves, then you've already won half the battle, right? Oh, the whip! You gotta be careful. And again, we were just talking about he's locked and loaded, ready to use that, uh, that starburst attack. Jeez, here we go. The choir, the angels, they're singing. It ain't over yet, though. It ain't over yet, though. King Ray Jr. definitely has a chance. Okay. Small pokes. Shadow trying to sidestep getting caught. Uh, King oh, Ray Jr. what an answer. They're trying to harass him with that back three. He just cannot find anything way to open up Shadow. Okay, these small pokes adding up. Oh, hop kick. He thought he was actually going to take a step forward. Uh-huh. There it okay, goes. The follow-up. Here we go. Let's see if he's able to get to the wall. Yes, he does. And the follow-up gets the full damage from the three-ring circus. Down, four, three. All right, King Ray Jr. Staying alive. Starting to piece it together. Okay. Uh-oh. Chopping away. Oh, okay. that's the first we've really seen that mm -hmm. from Yeah, Shadow. classy hop kicks, bro. Yeah, you can't, you can't use them all, man. Sometimes you got to do it and let them know. Get off. Hop kick again. Oh, he must. He's just rolling out the red carpet for you. Hit you, hit you with three of them bad boys. Got to give it, of course, to King Ray Jr. Showing a lot of growth in that set. But it just wasn't enough to go up against King uh, against Shadow. Yeah. Shadow's on fire, man. I'm telling you, he's, he's been doing so well. Shadow is a strong representative.